four-year-old male swallowed a double A battery. Oh, get that one a nine volt. Uh, what unit? We're looking for thirty-nine. Perfect. Yep. Let's see here. Knock knock. Hi. Hi, bud. Can we come in? Are you mom? Grandmother. Grandmother. Are you taking care of him today? Yes. Okay. Do you feel okay? Do you have anything that hurts? Do you have any owies? No? Okay, good. What happened? Did you swallow something? Yeah? What'd you swallow? Yes. Do you swallow a battery? Yeah. Okay. Your belly doesn't hurt. Do you have a hard time breathing? A little bit? Okay. All right, buddy. Well, we're going to check you out real fast, okay? How long ago did he uh, swallow the battery, would you say? 20 minutes ago. Okay. And I went in the bathroom with him and started two of my fingers down his throat. Uh-huh. Okay. Is that the one, kiddo? Do you eat that one? missing battery. See if we can't find it, okay? These are called my ears. It goes right in here, and I get to hear things. And I'm going to listen to your back, okay? You just take some deep breaths. Let me see how big you can breathe in. Breathe in big and deep. Yes. You take a deep breath. There you go. OK, you did such a good job. Grandma, so right now, his lungs sound good. He's got 100% oxygen in his blood. His pulse rate's right where it needs to be. You can see he's not in any sort of distress, anything like that. So it's not in his respiratory system, which is good. So um, we'll get on the phone, though. We can call poison control. They can give us a little bit better direction on uh, what they would like right, to do. It wasn't corroded. We'll run him down. He's not in any sort of distress. Um, his respirations were good. His lungs sound good. It's definitely not in his airway, which is our main concern. So a little bit of a peace of mind for Grandma here. Uh, we also contacted poison control just to get a little bit more of a direction. Um, they, uh, you know, have certain protocols that they go about. Poison control, say anything? Uh, yeah, they talked to the physician uh, with poison control. They were just worried about the battery, like, turning sideways in their stomach, not being able to pass. Uh, so they were recommended that he be transported so they could scope it and gotcha. see if he could pass it or if they need to remove it. Perfect. Uh, their main concern is if it turns sideways and doesn't pass, it could leak the internal acids from the battery. Gotcha. One, two, three. So they want him to be transported to the hospital where, again, they'll be able to scope him and visualize that battery and see if maybe they need to extract it or if it seems like it's in a good position to let nature do its course, we'll let him go ahead and pass it. So thanks, guys. Have a good night. Take care, buddy. Feel better, OK? You're going to be OK. Can I get a thumbs up? There it is. I like it, pal. Good job, bud.